Welcome to Chris Chadwick In Line. You're watching another In Line review. And today we're going to be talking about these. A new wheel from a company called Revolver from Loco Skates. Now, the aim of this is essentially to provide a high performance premium wheel at a budget price and in a range of sizes from an anti rocker wheel through 56s, 68s, all the way to 110s with other sizes in between. Now, straight off the bat, I can tell you that the price point of these wheels is a, definitely a success with a set of eight coming in at £45. Whereas normally you'd be looking at more like 60 to 70 pounds um, for an alternative choice from uh, premium wheel companies. But are they successful in terms of their performance? Keep watching to find out more. And while you're here, give this video a like and consider subscribing to this channel for more regular blading content. So my first impressions of the wheels, I really like the black and white um, aesthetic. They come with quite a large core and quite a nice sort of uh, sleek gold uh, print on there um, as well. I think they'll look great on a range of different setups and a simple colorway um, means they're not gonna clash um, with almost any option you care to pair them with. So I took them to one of my local skate parks um, to session the bowl, which I thought would be a great place uh, to put them through their paces, test the speed, test the grip, and I also wanted to see whether the elliptical profile on this 56 millimeter wheel um, would help to sort of reduce uh, wheel bite um, and make uh, grinding um, sort of easier and more enjoyable. So on the roll, my first impressions were they felt they felt definitely feel fast. I think this is partly sort of going to the to the kind of the large core um, large core on the wheel, um, which I think helps to increase the speed and sort of counterbalances that this is a, a soft wheel. Uh, they come in at 88A, um, but I think that combination, large core, softer wheel, definitely helps them to keep their speed really nicely. Um, the grip was also really good too. With other premium wheels, I have found they can be a little bit slippy, particularly for someone of my uh, build who's a little bit heavier, but I definitely didn't have any problems sort of coming around the corners in the bowl. They were um, holding onto the concrete really nicely. Um, and overall just a really nice feel to them. I did as well find that the elliptical shape on these definitely helped um, with reducing wheel bite. I previously had them set up um, with uh, flat profile wheels. Um, I did find I was getting some bite from time to time, but with these ones straight out of the box, no problems at all, which is unusual for putting a new set of wheels on here. Also found that this combination, the, the 68 with the, with the 56, I think I found the, the sort of the sweet spot for a high low frame here. I had the 7260 on before, which although you know it carried its speed really well, that front wheel can just feel a little bit cumbersome. You can feel like you're kind of rolling on your coping grinds and quite difficult to bone over on top sides until they've um, broken in a bit. Um, so definitely happy with the range of sizes um, that they offer here means that that setup was possible. In conclusion, I would definitely recommend these wheels. I think they've thoroughly succeeded with the premium wheel at a budget price. Um, I have no hesitation um, in recommending them. Go and get yourself a set. They're available exclusively through Loco Skates um, now. And thanks for watching this video. Consider subscribing to this uh, channel for more content. And thanks for watching. See you next time.